All right. Hello, everyone. I am looking forward to today's conversation with Gloria. How are you, Gloria? I'm very, very well. Thank you. I'm good. doing that well. Good, good. Well, Gloria, now, of course, mm -hmm. I know you, but we're going to start off this conversation and it's just an interview. So actually, it's just you yes. telling me about yourself. I see your notebook out, but I yes, want you to I tell have... us. <laughs> I want us to tell I want you to tell us about you. So, Gloria, can you introduce yourself? And yes, can you stay close to the camera? We want to see your beautiful face like that. Is Tell us. Better? Yeah. Where are you yes. from? Your hobbies? Anything you'd like us to know? Yes. Uh, my name is Gloria and I am from Colombia. Mm -hmm. But I have been living in Sweden for the last 11 years. Uh huh. Uh, yes, I was. Uh, I am um, business administration. Uh -huh. uh, and I, I thought I had to study what I want. I have, uh, I am working in what I want. So I am done. But uh, one day I met a Swedish man and all was changed. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Love changed yeah. everything. Yes. So now I am living here. We have two children, um, uh, 11 and 15 years old. Uh -huh. uh, yeah. And mm -hmm. um, yes, I, I had begun from the beginning here to learn the the, the languages or art. Yeah. So um I am next year I will be fifty. Wow. Amazing, wow. amazing. <laughs> yes. And I am I am very happy. Oh, I'm very happy to be with you today. It is my pleasure. I'm happy you're here too. You know what's one thing that I want I wanted to know? Because I know you <laughs> We've been in many of our mm -hmm. meetings. Gloria, what's your hobby? Yes, uh, I I think that I have a passion. Yes. Uh, my passion is to help people. I mm -hmm. like to encourage people and uh, I like to learn other what I can. So in my in my free time, I am uh, I, I am working at the office during the day, but uh, in my free time, I am leader. I had one a, a dance. Okay. Or, or, or another day, I had one physical training. Uh huh. But I am I my focus is for people that have not been working out for many many years, so that they maybe are overweight. Yeah. Or people uh, who have been sick. Uh, mm. or, or has been in one accident so they cannot go to the gym and, and do one yeah. normal workout so i am training very very much so i have that in there i am helping people because they i they need help this is help yeah and i am showing in the first time i i show how you exercise you do one thing yeah. but then i am i am showing how you do uh, many variations yeah. So though they can adapt uh, to their con conditions. So I am helping many, many people. Oh, I am excited. Okay, I just because want to when, point out. Oh, go ahead. Because when, go ahead, keep going. Now, uh, when I be, uh, uh, when I began this this training, uh, mm -hmm. it was only four people. Uh -huh. I was thinking, now I will continue. So uh, I, I began last uh, uh, Last year, uh -huh. and now it's sixteen persons, and they 16. are they are uh, 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 the, the best I have heard for them is, is the first time I can I have been uh, exercising uh, for a long time without a stop because this is wow. um, uh, this is uh, I can I I feel I can really do the my exercise so it is the best I can I love it. Uh, I love the expression on your face. Yes, Earlier when I, you were I introducing love. yourself, of course you were saying, you know, you have a family, of course you mentioned your husband and your children. And then when I asked you about your hobby and you said, Tiffany, it's my passion. Something happened to your facial expression. Right. Your face just lit up. So okay. I, I can tell that you're very passionate about it. And I know that your clients love you a lot. Yes, and I love them. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay, so you the best, uh, yeah, uh huh. 
as you as teacher, you uh, you know, when you are learning something to another mm -hmm. person and this person could, the best is when this person has the possibility to do that and say, now yes. I can. It's the best that one teacher can hear. Yes, and, and, uh, that's true. That's very true. I love it. I love it. Okay. So you have a passion for yes. helping people with their physical bodies, right? Helping them get back yes. in shape, right? Yes. yes. Wonderful husband, wonderful children. You live in Sweden. Yes. How in the world did English come into this picture? When did you decide uh, to start studying English? You will know. It is that <laughs> Uh, when I was in Colombia, I, I took one English course, but I was no, no using that. It is the Spanish now. So when I moved to Sweden, uh, I, I have not been using English at all. When, mm -hmm. when I moved here, in the first time, my, my husband is traveling very, very much. So the, 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 the only way to communicate here in the supermarket or in another place was in English. So I, I was using that all six months mm -hmm. but very basic mm -hmm. but during the last 10 years i have not been using english at all because mm -hmm. it is swedish i have been learning swedish swedish is difficult uh, the things special and um, vowels that if you are not pronouncing then you know <laughs> you, have, yes. you have been learning another so people don't understand you Mm -hmm. if you know. mm -hmm. So I have been, my focus has been in Swedish, Swedish, Swedish. But uh, now I am, uh, what is pushing me now is that first, my, my children, they mm -hmm. are, you know, you know, children, I, I play games. Yes. So for the most, it is in English. Mm -hmm. So my daughter, that is 11 and 13, they are talking in English with uh, friends. And her ma this uh, mother can know English, and my husband is Swedish. So the second language of here, uh, here is Swedish, mm -hmm. uh, English. So it is pushing me. I say no. I you are four, or only one cannot talk in English, and yeah. it will be no me. And the other thing is that uh, in my job, yeah. uh, right now I have been working in the municipality here mm -hmm. in, in the. And uh, I, right now, I had the possibility to get another position. And right now, I, I is a person that is going to retire, mm -hmm. and I am get I am getting her his, her job, and I am sitting with her, and I was thinking is the uh, payment account. So they are doing uh, international payment. Yeah, it that means uh, that I will need to communicate with banks with another in another country. Mm -hmm. And I was, oh my God, English! Mm -hmm. I need English right now. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, oh, I was looking for something, and one day I I watched one video from you, and it was this one where you are saying it's seven things that you must stop saying. Mm -hmm. or oh, you must have confidence mm -hmm. don't say you can I say what <laughs> I, 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 I felt so much confident mm -hmm. I say I will mm -hmm. take it and I I, I uh, bought the course so I have been in the in the community one and a half month I, I begin I began the 17th of July amazing and every day I love it every day. <laughs> now, just for those watching and listening, can you tell us which program? Are you in the Speak English Like a Native program or the daily English lessons, the 365 days? Which one are you in? I I was very, very ambitious because in the beginning, I, I, I uh, it was the, uh, the uh, app, Tiffany, uh, Tiffany app. Uh -huh. English uh, Tiffany app. I, mm -hmm. Yes, because I need to, I, 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 I want to begin to pronounce the vowels the, the, the uh, um, consonant that is more difficult so i booked it and it is like lifetime right uh, after i i book a weekly english word uh-huh yes me julie uh-huh and when i i i began to look more i, I 
365 days English. I will take it. So I bought this one ox, but it was marked very much for yes. the times that I had. So now I am not in the weekly English world, but, but you're I in the 365 or it is an app. So Good. sometimes when, when one word is very, very difficult, one, one vowel, so I am coming back and, and listen because you have very, very good explanation how you put the, the, the mouth or how you put the tongue. So I am coming back. I love that. Well, good. So the main one you're in is the 365 day English plan. I love that. So let me ask you this. You mentioned that sometimes pronunciation is a little bit challenging, right? Oh. And you kind of go to the app and check my pronunciation. What is the hardest thing for you right now as you're studying English? I know you have a goal. You want to be able to speak English because your kids speak English well. But what is the hardest thing for you right now? Right now is the pronunciation because I have had difficult to pronounce even in, in my uh, mm. language, uh, mother language. I have had mm. difficult to pronounce some vowels when I was a child. Mm. So I was training. I, I couldn't say my own name. name. I couldn't say Gloria. I say Goya. Oh. Oh. I was very difficult. So I I had a teacher in my school that you need to to. to to improve that. So now I am talking, but when I am pronouncing, uh, I feel difficult some, some words. Mm -hmm. So I need very, very much to, to work. And the other thing that is very hard is time mm -hmm. because I am working. I am a mother. My husband is traveling. So I had, when he's not mm -hmm. at home, so I had all, I had my kids and I had one kind of mother that I, want to help my, my kids. I want to be with them in the process yeah. if they are wake home mode wild. So from my job here at home I have to do and after that I have my, my trainings dance, Latino yes. American dance. Yeah. And so it is very, very, very difficult with time. So I have been to I uh adapt mm -hmm. my time to to could have the course. So it I, I am very organized, so I have my times to, or I have my goal, mm -hmm. and if you have a goal, you need to organize. And, yes, and exactly. So, so I have, my, my day is very, I uh, woke up at five o'clock. I and love begin, it. Yeah, I and begin with my, my schedule, because otherwise uh, you, you cannot to, to reach your goals. That's true. That's very true. Okay. So I love it. Again, I'm a very organized person as well. I get up early. I like things to be very structured. So let me ask you this then. So you mentioned the hardest thing being time, right? It does make it challenging. So when you do find the time to study, when you do find the time to watch the lessons or listen to the lessons, what do you enjoy the most? I'll even expand it and make it broader. You're a part of the family. I know it's only been a month and a half. What have you enjoyed the most? Has it been the lessons? Has it been the community? What have you enjoyed the most? I think it is old. I, I like mm -hmm. to be uh, in the community. You yeah. are meeting people from all around the world. Mm -hmm. And when, when it is so uh, uh, good when we are in, we have live conversation and we, we are in, in the rooms. Yes. So you are meeting people from, oh, or you are you are training to understand mm -hmm. because uh, uh, they have a sense. Yes. So when you are you are when we are talking with you, we understand. Yes. But when we are talking with another person that maybe we have not been never, so it is good because we are training, training, training. Or, and that. and to meet people is is very, very nice. I love it. I love it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. <laughs> So again, I see that smile on your face, just like when you talked about your passion, that smile came right on back. So let me go a little bit deeper. Okay. So you said you enjoy meeting people from around the world, right? So it seems like you're learning a lot. You're meeting new people. So how has your life changed? Again, I know it's only been a month and a half, but how has your life changed? I, I only can say that as I said, I have been in the community. Training English one and a half month. month. Right. Mm -hmm. 
And it has changed because I feel such a confidence that mm. I have never had before when talking yes. in English. I have not been talking in English ten years, but wow. since I began, I began in the in the um, community. And yes. We are in contact. We are looking for your videos. I feel so confident, and you I know, when it. you feel confidence, even when you are making mistakes, it is different. I love it. It is totally different. So now I am not afraid to talk in English, and I, I know I am making mistakes when pronouncing, but I don't think it is that I think I will improve. I am on the way and I am I am I will be talking in English very, very good in the future. But now I am enjoying the process and I need to make mistakes. I love it. I love so it. So so if if I love it. I love it. I love it. That's one of my biggest goals is it's to help everyone in the family, mm -hmm. everyone in the academy to experience that confidence. Yes. That confidence will take you very far. So, okay, you're feeling this confidence literally after only being with us for a month and a half, yes. right? Yes. Short period. Yes. So there's yes. much more to come. Things are gonna get even better. So yes. I want you to think about the future. I want you to think about mm -hmm. the future. What is your dream regarding English? You're like, ah, Tiffany, this is my goal right there. What is your dream? Yes, uh, my dream is to talk in English everywhere mm -hmm. without hesitate. Mm -hmm. I, uh, uh, because right now when, when we are beginning, when you need to talk, you are with, listen, in the, in your stomach, you listen, oh, I will make. So you are only talking as my mother tongue mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, that I will be. And I had one goal at the 30. First of December, I will be talking in English without hesitation. I love it. I love it. I I I, I will continue. I, I I really will continue. But uh, the, the vocabulary is necessary. Or, mm -hmm. or uh, as much as possible, when you are getting more and more words, expression, idioms, uh, phrasal bar, you feel more confident because when you are talking, there are there are open up. Yes. Yes. And you are. So this is my dream to talk in English when my husband and I am traveling uh, vacation or something because I don't feel confident. So it is he that while he's talking uh, at the airport because I feel oh, oh so so embarrassed. But I have uh, this time I am thinking I will learn English yes. once and for all. Yes, I love Never it. Never more afraid. Never more it. afraid of talking English. I love it. By December 31st, you all heard it. She's going to achieve it by December 31st. I love it. Yes. Okay. So everyone listening, watching right now, they just heard what your dream is. And they're listening to you have this conversation. What advice would you give them? If you could give one piece of advice to English learners, what would you tell them to remember? I uh, I would like to say uh, trust the process. Mm. Uh, you will talk in English, mm -hmm. and I I think that all of us have have done much more in, the, in our life. Mm -hmm. So to talk in English is in pro a process, but be be kind with you. Mm -hmm. and get you the time that you do you need uh, th 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 this is a process that you are doing and um, it, it, it is a part of the of the process that is coming yes but but try to be uh, involved in English for many ways i i can i can tell you how i i am doing because i am very busy so in them i can not study every day but i in the morning when i park my car so i have so the whole time, and I put the the class my three words, so I listen them in Good. in the day. Then uh, uh, at the next the, the next day, I am listening the the expressions and the idioms. So one day I I am sitting because I have been listening them examples. Yes. Of so I am doing my my sentences and sending the, them. So Great. every week I have I have one goal. I will do all the week in one week so uh, that I know I am not behind. I love but it. I cannot sit every day. 
but I am listening. In the morning I listen, the full trust. Tomorrow I put my, uh, when I go to the job, I put them while it's about 10 minutes to, and I, I hear in the words or the examples. So when I am sitting, I have, I have all, I don't, have t I don't need time to sit with them because mm -hmm. I have been hearing, hearing the whole time. So it is, it is very easy in a high city. So uh, my advice is find the way yeah. that is working for you because yes. you have, all of us have different situations in life. So if you have not so much time, uh, for example, I am a very, very early pe person. So I, I prefer to do things in early in the morning. But if yeah. you want me to 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 sleep early in the morning or you can be at night, so do uh, adapt that yes. to your condition. Or uh, it will be very, very easy because you don't say, don't feel they have pressure because it, you, are, you are doing precise what, well, how is easy for you. I love it. I love that I, answer. Yes. I, I want to, to say that because I am talking Swedish, sometimes when I am trying to talk in English, it is some Swedish word that is coming. So if you are hearing one uh, word very, very weird, it's, it's Swedish. <laughs> <laughs> you, know what's, you know what's funny, Gloria? Because I've been a teacher for so long and I've taught students from around the world, when that happens, I actually don't even pay attention to it because I can, I know what you're trying to say. So I, it kind of goes in and out the other ear. So no worries at all. No worries. Um, let me ask you this. This is my last question for you. Yes. yes. Do you have any questions for me? Anything that you'd like to ask me? Uh, uh, no, no question. I have not something to say to you. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, go ahead. The best thing that if you are a very good teacher and in the world is very good teacher, but it is something very, very special with you. Oh. And it is that you are encouraged people and you make people to feel confident. This is the key. Thank you. This is the really key that, mm -hmm. that made all students to get the, to, to, to continue and to be uh, easier to learn mm. because you are giving us confidence. When I saw the first video, I, I said, this is the woman that will mm. guide me mm. to my goal to talk mm. to you because I feel like this one, wow! <laughs> <laughs> I love it, I and, love it. And I'm, I, I am sure that many, many students have, feel, have felt mm. the same. That mm. it is, is because it is your passion. So mm -hmm. when you are, I, I understand because when I am learning to my, my trainees group dancing mm -hmm. and they get it is because they feel this passion. Yes. They really want that me to learn this. So they got it. Yeah. And I so love it. It is, it is, it is what I feel with you. I, I thank you. It's and very, it is very, very much material to 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 study. As when I am going, it is something I have to go, and I, it is much more bonus video. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, for example, those uh, about America, because yes. when you are uh, here in Dune, I have never been in America in the airport. <laughs> uh -huh. the airport. But you feel like some. I I have been there. Because the the person you are interviewing, they are they are talking about many things mm -hmm. in this place. So you are learning. I you have one special video. I, I cannot remember the name of the person, but she was talking about New York, and she's very 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 excited. She's talking about the Sabine? traffic. Yes, <laughs> yes. She's <laughs> smiling. So she's talking with the whole whole face. And she's talking about the traffic. If you are here, you need to go to know how the traffic is. So, so it is like you have been there. If you are mm. in New York, you know that you will be have to, to take a patient with the traffic because all those videos is, is helping us to, to, to learn about it. the culture. Mm? I um, love it. So Thank it's you much so more much. Material. Thank you so much for saying that. That is one yeah. of my main goals. And I mentioned that before in one of the previous interviews. 
I just want to help you all be more confident. If I can do that, I'll be happy. I can teach you different, I can give you different tips and skills and methods and techniques. But if you walk away being confident in yourself, that right there makes me happy. It makes me happy. Yeah. So, thank you so key. much. Thank you. Yeah. Gloria, I enjoyed our conversation. Thank you so much. Me too. You can <laughs> see it is, it is written in my face. <laughs> yes, written all over your face. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Gloria, well, I hope you have an amazing afternoon. What time is it there, actually? What time is it where you are? Uh, actually, here is a, a quarter past at night. Quarter past nine, you said? Past eight. Eight? Okay. Well, I hope at you night. have a wonderful mm -hmm. evening then. There we go. Yes. Evening. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks again so much, Gloria. I really enjoyed uh, it. Uh, I, me too. All right. Bye, hon. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs>